Douglas, you work here in the Paisley Museum. Tell us about this Sandy Stoddart exhibition that uh, you've just helped install over the last week. Okay, um, Sandy has grown up in the town of Paisley. He was born in Edinburgh, but he actually was educated here and went to the John Nielsen School. Uh, and for several years now, we've been wanting to do a major exhibition here to do with Sandy. Uh, it follows on a bit from ten years ago, we did a John Byrne exhibition, uh, which is the first major solo show we did here, and this is the, the second one on a major Paisley artist that we're doing. Uh, so Sandy is strongly attached to town. He could work anywhere in the world, but he still works at Paisley University. It's where the studio is. Uh, so, uh, and he's fantastically keen to do this exhibition here. So it's his first major museum exhibition that he's done. Uh, and it's a combination of works that he's prepared himself and also selections from our art collection, which inspired him as a child. Uh, and so he was able to remember paintings that he'd seen here. Uh, and so his inspiration came from our collections. And tell me a little bit about, this is a preparatory model for a Willie Gallagher monument that we're hoping to have in, in Paisley. So tell me a little bit about about that project? Well, Sandy's got several projects on the go at one time, and one that he's been looking at for a long time was to get a memorial for Willie Gallagher, the communist MP, uh, who came from Paisley. And he wanted a major memorial to Willie Gallagher in the centre of the town. Uh, Willie was remembered as a, a fantastic orator. He's one of the greatest speakers that Scotland produced. Uh, and a few years back, we did an exhibition on Willie Gallagher here, uh, and it was amazing that the people who came and remembered Willie. Uh, so he's someone that's very fondly remembered, and it, it's just beginning to go out of the consciousness of the people because obviously people are getting older and uh, they're, they're no longer around to remember Willie. When he used to be able to pack the St Andrews Halls in Glasgow, he could get 6,000 people to come and listen to him. And whether there were 6,000 communists around or just he was such a good speaker. But any politician would be pleased with 6,000 meetings. That sort of figure. Yes. Uh, so he was. He was fondly remembered by most of the people who he was with uh, in, and it would just be very fitting uh, This is the world. idea here that they should have a Fife Miner on one side and a Paisley Mill girl on, on yeah. the other and whereabouts is the obviously there's a huge fundraising appeal underway mm. to raise money but if and when we raise all the money, where, where is it hopefully going to be installed? It will hopefully stand in the High Street in Paisley. Uh, and so creating links between the sculptures that are already there on the High Street, as you walk along from the Abbey, uh, you've got statues of Alexander Wilson and Tanner Hill, then the fantastic Paisley War Memorial, and then we'll have Willie Gallagher. And at the far end of the street here, we have the statue of Witherspoon, uh, right. which is both in front of Paisley University and also another copy in front of Princeton. And that statue was done by Sandy already. So it it's, would be brilliant to have more of his works in the town. Well, it's a great project, so everybody should come to the museum over the next few weeks and see for themselves Sandy's just extraordinary work. Douglas, thank you very much. Thank you.